yeah, the captain's dead now, which means our men are leaderless and are, will be even more demoralised because they have no direction. And these guys will fight to the death in their town centre. As you would. Let's follow this guy here now. This, th this man here. So he's like, oh no! Look at this wall, wall coming towards. Oh, he's, he doesn't want that now. Look at this wall, just. Oh, he's dead, I think. I took my eyes off him. Or is this him? Look at this wall of, like, green. Just. <laughs> this guy's left. No, he got stabbed in the gut. Whoa. And, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's ours now. <laughs> hey, let's watch this guy. Is he gonna? This let's is continue no the world. Battle. This is a hunt. No, a coward chase. A coward chase. This is a great victory. Yay. The cries of dying enemies are sweet music to our warriors. <laughs> Yay. Clear victory. Uh, men deployed 1.5k. We lost 200 men. Did we? No. 300. Yeah, just under 300 men we lost. But killed all of theirs. All 800. Excuse me. Burping like Kamofo. Right. London is ours! Yes, that means Britain is completely under Celtic control. The land is ours. Oh, okay. This settlement has fallen to the might of your army. Victory is yours and the fate of the settlement lies in your hands. Um, occupy, enslave, or exterminate. Hmm. We don't really want to exterminate them because we need them in our army. So... Yeah, the looting's good, but long term we're talking. Um, what we want to do, we'll just occupy it, I think. Yeah, just occupy the settlement. Because we need the soldiers. And we need somewhat happiness of the people. Your Honor. Right, let's see what's going on here. Boats ready. So these. These guys are still determined. Uh, let's try and recruit some boats, can we? Why can't we recruit? Oh, not enough money. Shit. Let's have a look at how much we'll make the next turn. Uh, projected two grand. Right, okay. And turn. Oh, look at that. 2,777 gold. So, you see... I knew that there was... I knew that there was going to be something up. The Romano-British faction leader. <coughs> Excuse me. I knew that we weren't alone on the island. Um... Shit, those guys are tough as well. Um, damn it, they were the. Oh, I just knocked the mic. You might have heard that. I don't know. Um, shit, this is gonna. Be, these guys are like. Um, it was to be honest when I was starting this campaign, it was between picking the Celts or the Romano-British faction, and. I picked the these Celts obviously because I'm Welsh. Um, uh, shit. What's the most tactical thing to do at this point? Do we wait and see what they do? Because there's a completely undefended settlement up there, and they could take that easily. Um, we've got majority spearmen. We've got a couple of heavy uh, knights. I think we should intercept them. Let's save just in case shit goes down. 
Uh, Celtic Empire. Alright. So that means somewhere down here now, there's another settlement. Um, which is a problem because I don't actually know where they are. So, okay. Yes. Uh, yeah, we're going to attack these guys to get them off our land. Attack a neutral faction. Uh, they're not neutral because as soon as I s turn my back on them, they'll take my land. Lol, lol, lol. Uh. Right. There are hostilities between you. There are no hostilities between you and the army and this army's faction. If you attack now, it will be considered a declaration of war. Are you sure you wish to proceed? Wait, no. Let's hold back a minute. Uh. They've got archers, unknown units. Shit. They've got good. I forgot about that faction completely. They've even got a little dragon. I wonder if they are whales. I don't know. Um, like the. I don't know. The Celts are Welsh. I know that. Um. But where are these guys at? Because I was wondering, why is there no Celtic building here? Does that mean they're there, in Cardiff? Or are they in Cornwall here? But even then, this whole part of Wales here, and uh, southern England on this side, and even here, um, I, can't, I think this is Brittany, in, that's what the region was called in France, all down here was Celtic. Um... So, I think we are going to wipe out their army. We have to. Otherwise, they'll get us. Hmm. Shit. Didn't think about this. What if... Oh, they've got mines. That'll make us some monies. Monies. Lord. Yeah, General. let's do this. Yeah, let's do it. Got to get them off our land, boys. This might be a tough fight, though. <sighs> Shit. There. The odds are against us. To say the least, I've been in worse battles than this, to be honest. I've defended settlements with only 300 men against armies of thousands. It's all a matter of choosing... Um, it's all a matter of tactics. But if you notice, they had lots of cavalry. So, if we preserve our horse archers... Today is a grim day right, for our enemies. Guy. They face us. They must know they only have moments left to live. Huh. Now let this be war to the knife. Harden your heart and think of our women folk. Let this be a day for triumph. Yeah. I knew that this was going to be tough, so let's do this. Await my orders. Right. The key to winning this now is to trapping them and catching them out off guard. Because these guys, I'm going to hold these guys in reserve. Let's get these the gallo glasses up here. I'm not sure if they... I think they have got archers, haven't they? They've got quite a lot. Let's group all my spearmen together, because we don't have any battering rams to worry about this time. What if I ungroup them? Yeah, they do. Nice, they stay together. That's the core of our army, the spearmen, so... I hope the mercs don't rout really quick, because I need them... Because the mercenaries are paid, aren't they? So, and they've got woodland and an uphill. Oh shit! This battle is really against us. If it could ever be. Um. 